events if they're not dealing with anything like transgenderness but there's been a lot of things happening that I really didn't talk about you know <clears throat> well the newest thing about Osama bin Laden so you know I just hope now that we got him he's dead let's move on and let's do some productive stuff in life um, I'm really happy with all the um, changes that are going through um, with a lot of the countries in the Middle East. So I'm hoping that will bring um, new people, new ideas, and um, let's not just assume everyone is the same because we are all unique. We have different things. So that's the current event. Um, one thing that has happened to me yesterday actually, I stubbed my toe and right now it's not hurting anymore but it is still bruised. I'm not going to show that to you guys. So you probably won't, probably won't see my feet in a couple more weeks probably. I don't have any stockings on. No pantyhose. Um, basically because someone told me they like my bare thighs and legs so I'll show them. It's not perfect so I'm not perfect, yes, I know, everybody's going to be so sorry to hear that, but everyone's not perfect, okay? So. so, so that's basically what's happening. Um, so tomorrow is going to be Sunday, which is going to be Mother's Day, and to all the mothers out there, I just want to say Happy Mother's Day. Um, if it wasn't for you, we would not be here. So that's very important. Um, and also, to any of your mothers out there, Happy Mother's Day. Uh, tomorrow I'll be spending it with my mother. Um, probably my um, brother's family going to come down and um, we might have a barbecue or something. I don't really know. It's always just something new happens. I don't know. <laughs> so I think that'll be okay. That'll be fun. Um, I have some money that I can actually pay for some dresses, maybe a new wig, I don't know. Um, I already, I'm already starting bidding on some dresses, but you know the ones that I like, I'm looking, for, I saw them, but the dresses that I saw on Amazon was just too expensive. The ones that I really like, and what I really want, are it was strapless, but it's like a wrap around the shoulder. I love those. 
I always thought they were so beautiful on, you know, when I see a woman wearing them, I always thought just a little, you know, wrap around the shoulders and around and strapless, I thought that was so sexy. So I'm looking for that, but I haven't really found any. A lot of those, some of those that I bought just didn't fit or they're like see-through and I can't show that on YouTube. I can go on Xtube and show that, and maybe one of these days I will, but right now, you know, I think I have like three dresses that are kind of see-through, and yeah, I'm just a guy in a dress, but, you know, if you see too much, they'll think, you know, it's, it's this whole thing about, you know, a guy topless is fine. A woman topless is nude, and a guy dressing up as a woman topless is in that little middle ground, I guess. I don't know, it's, it's kind of weird. It's, I, I don't know. So I, I just don't want to play around with that. Um, I don't have real breasts. So I don't know what else to say. Um, I think that's about it. And this position is really killing me. I should I should be in a chair right now. But I kind of was like in a hurry. I'm, I was trying to get this stuff out. And I just wanted to get this done. So I'm hoping this will come out nicely. I actually wanted to talk about one of my older videos. Oh, um, I got a comment on there. Um, about my video on um, drag queen versus transvestite versus crossdresser, and this person was going on like cro a transvestite and a drag queen are the same, and I tried to explain no, they're not. Uh, the reason why they dress up are different. Um, so I, I tried to explain and the thing was, it's like, I'm not going to argue about it. <laughs> you know, all you have to look it up, you look it up in the dictionary, you look it up in the encyclopedia, there's a difference. Hello? You know, it's not just my opinion. Now, if you call me a drag queen, I think I would have a problem. If you call you know, another transvestite, I think they would have a problem too. Um, drag queens are just totally different. Um, but a drag queen can be a transvestite, and a transvestite can be a drag queen. So it's not like, you know, there's no, it's, it's not like there's no exceptions. It's just the meaning, there are differences. And when you think about drag queens, Usually, they're in the gay community performing, and that's where it, that's the main reason why they're dressing up. That's about it. Um, if you go to a drag queen and tell them that you're a transvestite, they wouldn't mind. I I truly don't think they're gonna say, "Oh my gosh, no, I'm not." Um, I don't think they would care because the thing is. A transvestite is, some, is someone who dresses up in the other sex's clothes, so I'm not dressing up just to perform. You know, yeah, I'm on YouTube, yeah, I'm showing everybody out there, yeah, I show a little skin, um, yeah, sometimes I do overdo my makeup, but the reasons why I am dressing up is for me. That's it. I like it. It's fun. You know, I have this urge. I just... I don't know. I just like it. I like being sexy. And I like the look. Um, if I wasn't doing videos and pictures, um, I probably wouldn't be wearing the wig. I think that's about it. I am so hot. So sexy. So hot. <laughs>
Okay, everybody, I'm gonna have to go. I hope you like the um, credits that I do sometimes. Sometimes I feel like it's kind of cheesy, but it's my video. I am the director, I am the editor, and I do what I want. And if people don't like it, mm, I might change it, and then again, I might not. Because I am in control. Oh my god.